All right, so today I wanted to just kind of go through uh, finishing your model for your for your base, and uh, I want you guys to understand that the base is going to sit, the 18-inch dimension is going to sit lengthwise on your site, okay? So, uh, I'm sorry? No, Okay. So I want to show you guys how to mark up the top of your base model and also how to cut that stuff out of here, okay? So to do that, all we're going to do is use a pin. I'm going to locate this thing underneath here, kind of line it up and orient it so that it's facing correctly. So what I'm doing is I'm lining up the end of the parking area with the edge of my um, surface that I have. And, and what I'm, what I'm going to do is I'm going to use a pin, a little push pin, to mark um, the key points of where things go. Then I'm going to cut them out of that board and put them all over onto here. So one of the very first things that I need to demarcate is where the corners of my developable property are, which are right there and there. Okay. Next thing I need to do is to locate the corners of where the setbacks are. So I'm going to put four little pinholes there. Okay. Um, this is a straight line, so that one will be fairly easy to cut. And this is an arcing line, so that one will have to cut from a pattern itself. But this will kind of generally give me the direction that things are going. I'm just using the pin to kind of mark a few points, mark where the driveways are located. And at any point, I can also use it to, to kind of realign everything. Okay? So when I'm done, we've got all these sort of pinholes all over the surface of this thing. Okay? And that's what I'm going to use as I cut the pieces out to sort of locate them onto this thing. Any questions about that? Um, if you don't get all of the pin locations the first time, then realign your pins and finish doing that. The next thing that has to happen is I need to cut out these sidewalks, okay? And the way that I'm going to cut those out is I'm going to cut them out so that um, it's going to include all of the little planter areas as part of the raised up area, okay? So, um, this is like I mentioned, this is kind of an old version of this. I'll, I'll find a newer version. One right here. So what we're trying to do is we're trying to show um, where the various sort of walkways and stuff are. This is really too thick and our site doesn't dip down, but this is all only done for illustrative purposes, right? There really isn't a dip down right there. Okay? Sorry about that. Okay. Um, so, uh, we need to kind of make all of these little pieces that are located in here. And so I'm going to go ahead and start making those from this board. And you don't have to cut, I've, I've seen people where they basically use an entire board to cut out the thing all at once. You don't have to do that. This one was cut that way. Um, you can cut these things out in sort of long strips if you want. Okay. So um, I'm going to start by just cutting this sidewalk here, that sidewalk there, that one, and then the arcing part that's right here. Okay. The same technique is going to apply. So I'm going to... Um, Turn that over like this so it makes it a little easier for the camera to see. And I'm going to use the pin to sort of demarcate the corners for this thing so that I can cut it out. All right.
and I believe this line runs dead straight. until it gets to um, this corner point right here. Then it starts to kind of create more of an arcing form. And so for the arcing form, I'm just going to kind of intermittently space little pinholes. And that should be enough where I can redraw that and find a pencil. Got lots of pens. I don't seem to have a pencil. Oh, thank you. Okay, so that's, that sort of gives me the sidewalk that I need right there. I'm just going to cut it out and line it up with that to make sure that it looks correct. And there's my overall um, sort of sidewalk, which uh, I want you guys to understand. We're going to cut out the. Um, let's see what side this one goes on. Uh, the side. Actually, over here, right? Yep. What I'm looking for is the, the wider end of this trapezoid, which is like that. So the curved part is over on this side. So it says something like that there. Not seeing the pin marks here that I thought I put. All right, so that'll go something like that, and then I'm going to cut out the pieces. Um, a different way that you can do this is to, to literally redraw this on, up on top of this thing if you want to. Okay? So the key thing for you guys is that I need you guys to make it sort of look like that. Okay? Any questions about that? No? I'll go ahead and finish this one up. So you guys can go ahead and start working on this part of this. I also want to go through now and kind of look at each of your designs and see how they kind of relate to um, the canopy to the, um, uh, to the terminal building, okay?
All right.